Hello and welcome to the C tutorial. So in this video, we'll study what is C programming. So before we start C programming, I'm मैं ये बता दूँ कि हम लोग ये subject पढ़ क्यों रहे हैं. So as we know that programming is a very important part of computer, computer learning. Or through programming only we can interact or communicate with the computer. So and C language. is one of the most important languages ever discovered or ever invented so for uh, the people who would like to know the history of c c is a programming language language developed at a t and t s bell laboratories of usa now this was a laboratory name a t and t bell laboratories in usa is yahan par c language ko pehli baar develop kiya gaya at In the year nineteen seventy two. Now, who invented it? So, it was first designed and implemented by. By the sign by a computer learner named Dennis Ritchie. So this was the name of the computer learner who developed C programming language. So now let me tell you the types of C. so here uh, we have different types of c like run c microsoft c turbo c so these are the types of c that we are going to learn or that we are going to discuss later in our video after discussing what is c let us discuss what are the advantages of c programming advantages of c programming to so, pehla advantage hai c is a function oriented language a uh, the first thing that, that uh, the first abbreviation or the first new word that we came across is function oriented abhi function oriented kya hota hai so you know what is a function a function is nothing but a method or a set of instruction which is uh, Encapsulated and is run at a time. जैसे कि normal functions, uh, if in in the real world we can we can relate to functions in this way. Like peeling a banana can be a function. So peeling a banana. वट दिस ये ये एक्टिविटी क्या कहता है यू पील अ बनाना वी रिमूव द स्किन ऑफ द आउटर स्किन ऑफ द बनाना सो इट इज डूइंग समथिंग इट इज अ डूअर और एक्शन मेकअप सो यूर इन द लैंग्वेज सी फंक्शन आर ऑल्सो द एक्शन मेकर्स ओके 
we will discuss the functions later on in our tutorial so c is function oriented like we use functions in order to form the c language or the form the c programming now the second advantage is c runs faster than any other compiler the code of C is very 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 simple and in understandable by the system very easily. Easily, it runs very compiler se jaldi run karta hai. Uh, Obviously, the more uh, number of instructions the computer will be able to uh, process in less time because it is simple and easy to understand even by the computer. So, third, uh, third advantage is it is highly portable. C is highly portable now what is portable portable here means you can carry your your code from one place to another without without actually taking care of the system it is being run so it is it is easy to carry now the code is so compact that you can easily run it from one system to another and without taking you know without any fail Number fourth is C has a rich library. Rich library of operations and instructions. Having a library means what? Just like a normal library, we have books. So uh, those books we can easily access and we can study from those books. So um, one person need not uh, go and buy books and uh, book those books and search for those books anywhere else. So here also, जितने भी जो भी library है C के पास उसमें ढेर सारे instructions पहले से store किए हुए हैं. Like you don't have to look for them outside. और खुद से बार बार लिखने की जरूरत नहीं होती. You just import that function or operation from the library and then you can use it in your program. So fifth one is C is highly compatible with the hardware of the computer. This is because many of the C instructions are in assembly language which is easily understandable by the hardware so easily jitne bhi sare operating systems including window is programmed in c so that it can easily it can uh, easily interact with the hardware or give the hardware direct instructions to work um, to work as the user wants Chal. अब हम लोग डायरेक्टली प्रोग्रामिंग पार्ट में आ जाते हैं कि अब हम लोग सी प्रोग्राम लिखेंगे कैसे सो लेट अस स्टार्ट विद द बेसिक्स सो सबसे पहले जो चीज आप लोग के यू विल कम अक्रॉस व्हाइल राइटिंग द प्रोग्राम द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग थिंग दैट वी विल कम अक्रॉस इज द सी कैरेक्टर सेट सी कैरेक्टर सेट सो व्हाट इज अ कैरेक्टर सेट बेसिकली any language or um, any language may uh, let it be english or hindi anything uh, requires some character sets to build words like in english a to z is the character set by which each and every word of the, of english language is built in hindi kaise gaya so so is uh, so in c this is only the character set which is used as uh, English is the higher level. It is written in higher level language. So A to Z he who character set that which we use in C. Now with this character set use, karke, we form various keywords, variables, constants, etc. So this. Character set ko use karke, including those numbers from 0 to 9. 
and some special characters. Characters like uh, at the rate asterisk slash food dot etc so these are some characters and these are some numbers or the character set which is used to form keywords variables constants and etc so this, for describing we let us begin with the constants आखिर कॉन्स्टेंट्स है क्या कॉन्स्टेंट का मतलब इन जनरल इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज इज समथिंग विच इज विच डज नॉट चेंज इट इज कॉन्स्टेंट सो वैसे ही यहाँ पे भी इसका मतलब सेम है कि ऐसे वैल्यूज uh, जो कि चेंज नहीं होते अब क्यों चेंज नहीं होते और कहाँ चेंज नहीं होते विल डिस्कस इट सो इट इज दीज आर वैल्यूज विच डू नॉट change throughout the execution of a c program so now what new words we came across is execution okay so what is execution of a program execution is compiling when we write a program jab hum log program likh ke ready ho jate hain uske baad phir we compile that code taki uh, high level language low level language mein convert ho jaye aur easily computer usko samajh sake theek hai to usi process ko hum log kehte hain execution the process of uh, compiling a code giving some input and getting some output is the full execution process ठीक है तो कांस्टेंट ऐसे वैल्यूज है ना जो कि जब तक प्रोग्राम का एग्जीक्यूशन हो रहा है वो चेंज नहीं होते हैं दे रिमेन कांस्टेंट एग्जांपल एनी नंबर वन टू थ्री और एनी नेम लाइक दीपिका और एनी कैरेक्टर लाइक ए और यू नो any value any boolean value like true or false these are some constants which we use in c so friends here we come to the end of this video next uh, next uh, we'll discuss all the other topics in our upcoming videos so stay tuned mm -hmm.